Kalash, Kilish, Kalash. Good morning, guys. Today is Saturday, the 24th. It is actually my last full day in Jamaica. But I'm actually about to get some things done. I'm gonna head to the ATM and then I'm gonna go hurry up and pull up my hair. And I got my cousin helping me, so it should be really fast. I gotta wash it mega fast, get this over with so I can get a new style, go back home, go back to work in the week. And then tonight, I'm not so sure what tonight brings because I haven't yet to pack, but I don't have a lot of things to pack, so it'll be easy for me. I got my snacks out the way and everything already. Um, and yeah. That's it. I just have to worry about my hair and packing a little bit of things. And I'm not so sure what tonight brings. So, when I'm done pulling out my hair and washing it, I'll show you guys when Nicole's doing it later. But I need to hurry up and go join this ATM line because the people who live in Jamaica or the tourists who come here often know that Scotia Bank line. What? You know how it stay if you don't get there by a certain time. It's either you go mega, mega early or mega, mega late. Honestly, or else you're just not gonna get through. You have to have some serious patience to be in that line. But anyways, um, yeah, I'm about to I'm about to head over there now. I'll see you guys later. Good morning, guys. So, Hale's just finished, and Beauty actually just finished pulling out my hair. I helped a little bit. Guys, look at it. Some of it's right here. I need to go wash it now. Beauty's gonna wash that for me, cause guys, my head smell like rotten BK fries. I'm exaggerating, but to me, yeah, because it's just hot and sweaty. So I'm going to wash that shortly, and then I'm going to go over. Nicole's waiting on me. So um, I'm going to show you guys the process of the washing, or I'll come back when it's fully washed, because you know, I'm not looking half decent right now. But when I reach over to Nicole, I'll let you guys see her. Hey, guys, so I ended up doing my hair myself i had to wash it up myself and pull it after i had a little help from beauty but um this is it i'm gonna blow dry it shortly so waiting on my cousin to come and do the braids she's not here as yet guys i got rid of all the bleach ends and i'm loving my natural hair color like i never used to love it i used to hate it but guys the dark what it fits me just it just gives off my face like look at it maybe maybe it might sound like i'm bugging but to me i see something but I'll let you guys see Nicole when she gets here. I'm gonna go blow dry this. Or Brittany, one of the two of us. Guys, Brittany thought out a little bag juice for me. I'm gonna attempt to drink it without nasty on myself because. <laughs> Mm, give me this. I come off camera. Guys, hey, look who finally made it. Nicole's here. Just gonna start my hair. Gonna blow dry it. Get to the good part. So I'll take you guys along the process. Yeah. Guys, we're outside. Nicole started the hair. It's just Tara. She has the hair in her hand. So there's Breeze outside. So just chilling in a bag juice. Cheers, come. <laughs> 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 Some of my bones. Mm -hmm. So I'll show you guys when she's done. Or walk you throughout the progress, at least. Alright, this is it so far, guys. It's looking nice. Jumbo. Uh, Nicole's taking a little break, taking a breeze. Uh, I just can't wait to be done. My line is hurting, guys. Been sitting down for too long. And then I'm gonna go shower up and get ready to go to south. I'm getting kind of tired and it's kind of hot outside. I'll show you the finished product whenever Nicole's done. Good afternoon guys, so this is the final result, curled ends and everything. Yep, I didn't want to do so, this is the design. I'll even insert a couple pictures in a video as well. So just got home and we're gonna go to Sava, pick up a little last minute things, cause it's my last official night. And maybe we'll just go out to dinner, you know, go have a drink, set up my last night here. Yeah. I'm kind of sad, but at the same time, I'm really mad because I know I'm coming back. I know I'm coming back, guys. So, I'm just going to sit here and pull off in the fan. 
and go to a couple stores and then come back and get ready for a good evening guys so once again we're in a different vehicle actually a bigger vehicle we're in a taxi it's actually somebody's taxi but you just switch it out for a higher ride you know just for fun you know it's fun to get low down <laughs> Yeah, so we're gonna head into seven now. Alright guys, we just got the rest of the goods to bring home. I don't want to pull up the box, but we got a couple of these honey bun donuts, kiss cakes, I just these ping pongs. I'm gonna surprise my brother. He doesn't know I'm bringing back this much stuff. So if you didn't love me before, he surely loves me now. I'm putting <laughs> I'm like extremely hungry and this is the one of the worst things on the planet so imagine if I wasn't hungry and I was being greedy what it would taste like but thank god everyone's here my vacuum cleaner so it's not going to waste <laughs> guys he took out this long piece of corn you could just tell it was tough <laughs> at least the guy in midday was tough but no I just did a soup this soup can't drink unless you're like desperate to bust gas. Yes, that's that type of soup. So, we have to get something to eat. We really do. Okay, guys, so we stopped at this place. I don't Gazebo. remember the name, but I'll insert it. Gazebo, something gazebo. Drinking a little pumpkin and chicken soup. Putting um, on our order, even though there's not really any food in my show, but. It's about the rain. It's about the rain, and this man's obsessed with the. Boy! Huh? This man's obsessed with. The dirty flower water. No, it's nice. Look on the roots inside, right? See the roots? You see the roots, guys? It's about to pour. It's really about to pour. And I'm hoping that the order is successful before it even starts tearing. <laughs> before it starts tearing. But it's kind of feeling cool now. We got a couple other snacks to bring home. We're going to get the food and go home. I think while we're waiting for the rain to ease off, I'm gonna start packing some stuff. Oh god, no, I actually have to go back to Auntie Julie and say my goodbyes because I'm leaving early tomorrow and pick up the last minute things from her. So, but guys, I'm about to tear up this soup and while I'm waiting on this food. So, yeah. Alright, guys, we got our food. This is mine. I got a little curry gold with a piece of fried chicken and fries and Pudding got rice and peas, curry gold and chicken. You already know he's gonna eat off some mine. And we got strawberry and mango mixed factories, guys. Mm -hmm. The soup was good. Definitely helped my belt real quick. But I'm about to dive into this and it's about to pour, so I'm about to be like, we're gonna hurry up and, and go. Guys, we just finished eating at um, this place called El Gazebo's. So, how was it? What do you give it a rating? What rating do you give it? Or, oh, that's it. Because this is really refreshing. This is like he was saying this is the most 
that we've ever received in like a daiquiri cup series. And it's true. This is the most we received. It was, guys, it was full right here where you see the mark. And it was only $700 each, so that's good. But the more in mine melts, for some reason I'm tasting the liquor even more. It tastes really good. My curry goat was really good. It could have used a tiny tip of pepper, but it was really good. What about you? You like yours? Mm -hmm. I like your food? Mm -hmm. It was good. Everyone's been there before. I have not It was It was good. So now we're going to go into a store and see if we can try and get like a fan or something. Because guys, the time is hot down here. Like Jamaica is not a real place. So we'll need it. But we're trying to beat this rain, so. 